Hey guys, so it is September and for some of you guys know, um, I started ordering the Ipsy bag. Uh, I mentioned it in my uh, post last night that I had gotten my Ipsy bag and I was going to do a bag opening for you guys. Hey Astral! And so we're going to do the opening. Forgive me, I'm getting comfortable. I'm in my bed right now, sitting. Um, so we've got the bag. I do have a Sephora bag coming, but it won't be here. The Sephora play won't be here until next week. Hold on, guys. I'm going to shift you guys around. I got my tripod working, so that helps. So this is September's. Um, I have already pulled the part open, but I have not actually taken stuff out. Let's you guys up a, just a hair there we go okay technical difficulty so for those that don't know what ipsy bag is um it is a uh monthly subscription you get of different cosmetics hair stuff facial creams uh, masks and perfumes uh, I believe you can get perfumes. I haven't gotten any of those still yet, but that you can get every month um, for 10 bucks. They're sample size, although I have gotten some um, like regular sized ones as well. So um, it just depends. Um, I have not done a comparison. Uh... Hey, little born, uh, reborn bubbas. I haven't talked to you in forever. Um, so. I haven't, I, like I said, I get this, uh, this one, which is Ipsy. I get Sephora. Um, I have not tried Birch, Birch Box, although um, another YouTuber, um, Pink Glam Girl, check her out. Um, she has told me to try the Birch Box because those you actually get like full size samples uh, instead of those small ones. So, what I like about this bag is you get, not only do you get your really cute little, um, <coughs> excuse me <coughs> not only do you get your um samples but with this one you get like really cute little bags which for me is awesome because i like to change my makeup bags or um the bags i use in my purse every month so i really enjoy this um i've had some really cute ones so far um this one was supposed to be super cute so here's the bag and this is the September's bag. It's really cute. It's got the super cute little lashes on it. I really like this one. Um, it's got the little gold. It's kind of hard to see. There we go. The little gold um, tassel. And it's hard to tell, but it's also like a gold bottle. Bottom. Blah, 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 <laughs> a gold bottom. I love the pink bubble mailer. Yes, I love these. I've actually held on to them because um, I'm going to use them uh, just for like mail outs too because they're super cute. That's the one thing I like about them. Sephora's comes in a box. This one comes in the super cute pink bag. So, we'll look, see inside, yay. First thing I pull is the card. And this month says, the question isn't who is going to let me, it's who's going to stop me. Um, hashtag Ipsy, September 2018. And then on the back, this says, uh, disrupt the system, smash the status quo, make some noise. This month's glam bag plus your five personalized picks are here to help you stand out in the crowd. Create a scene and express your own unique beauty. Want to color outside the lines? Head over to Ipsy app for tons of Ipsos on how to break the beauty rules. Want more reasons to lash out literally? Here are some Ipsy shoppers top lash boosting formulas and it gives the three of them uh three different ones and it says p.s don't forget to rate your picks for by september 30th to get more customized picks next month and then only for ipsy shoppers a 30 percent cash back on all of these those are the ones you ordered hey you subscribed to me hey hi how nice to meet you um pamela din um hi tammy I'm okay so you guys i'm like jumping all over the place here so, thank you for subscribing, Pamela. Um, as you guys know, most of the time my page is about um, my Reborns, but I also am doing um, the monthly bags. Like I said, I will have a Sephora bag. Uh, I think it's supposed to be your Wednesday. So, like I said, this is my bag. 
Um, also, when I ordered this, when I got this one this month, I had had enough points to redeem something else. So there is an extra in my bag, um, which I will show you guys. So the first thing in the bag is I got the new moisture Insta Fix Revive, and um, it's just Revive, and it's the Numa Natural Addictions. This is the hairspray leave-in conditioner spray. Um, I've actually read, when I read the actual, um, I'm good, uh, Pamela, I'm doing real good today. Um, when I read the reviews on it from other people, a lot of people said it was a little heavy because it's a little thicker, but it was really nice. This one says it's lightweight, but, um, my hair, because I live in, um, the South, it tends to be a little more dry anyway. So I cannot wait to try this one. Um, and actually, I think it's a pretty, pretty decent size little sample. I mean, just to try. Pamela, you said you're so beautiful. Thank you. I really appreciate that. I'll be honest with you guys. I, I have makeup on. I it's late, and so I didn't like refresh my makeup. I should have, but I didn't. Um, normally, you guys see me like at my worst, but thank you. I really appreciate that. Actually, that made me feel really good today. Um, so the next thing is let's see oh this is the lip crayon this one is the mana beauty beauty simplified yeah i really need to work on my talking today beauty simplified lip locked step three primed lip one and bell okay so let's see if you guys can see it's this color here and i'll show you with the lid off I gotta keep remembering my camera is over here. And I will do like a little swatch test for you guys. See, I really like that. And it is a sparkly. I don't know if you guys can tell. I'm waiting for it to come on. Doo -doo -doo. Okay, well, it's not gonna come clear in, but it is a sparkly um, lip wand. So I really like that. That's actually really pretty, um, especially this time of year. It's kind of a berry color. I guess I would say um and this is to me and I know I do know because I read somewhere else too that it is the you know retractables which I really like too so you don't have to worry about uh you don't have to worry about doing the um lip sharpening um this one is a pretty decent size I don't use a whole lot of lipstick a lot I mean, I don't go out a huge amount of time. Um, but that one will last me a decent amount of time. Okay, so the next thing in my bag. Oh, how cute. Oh my gosh, I just saw this. Okay, so inside my bag, and I've never noticed them being a little saying inside. This one says, rules were made to be broken. And I know it's going to be backwards. Let's see if it'll focus. That was so cute. I might have to look at my other bags. There Maybe there was other things in that. Okay, so this one is the Dochi, I think is what it's called, Cheek Blush. And I'll pull it out here in just a second. And the color is 611 RSVP. See, and I like this too. It comes in this little cute container. I like that, that's a pretty color see if I can get a little swatch of it for you guys to see yeah see it's a very light which I like um I like a lot of neutral colors so actually that will probably work really well for me and for a lot of people a lot of women are doing now the um like where they make the the magnetics where you can put like your own specific things you want it so these are really good too in these samples because you can take it out, stick it on your little magnet board. I haven't done that yet, although I've gotten a bunch of these like this, so now I'm thinking about um, making my own little magnet board for my makeups. So, and it comes in, I'll show you guys again, it comes in this cute little sample box. I, have, I will have to do, if you guys are really interested, I'll do a, um, like my makeup, basket i have a big basket right now okay this is called morph 
high impact highlighter and illuminator. Okay, and the color on this one was, oh, it was just highlighter and, oh no, spark, my bad. Duh, it was on the top. See, to me, that's a, a really nice little size compact. There it is. It's very highly, let's see if I can get it close enough, very shimmery. Let's see if you guys can see it. No, it's not going to show up on that side. Let me move it to this side. the way my lights are in this room but you guys can kind of see it shimmering on my hand um i actually like this one i have not really played around with a lot of the highlighters um because <laughs> i just know i'm gonna mess it up but i'm really i think i really am this is the first highlighter i've actually gotten so i think i'm really gonna test this one out and uh, see if i like it okay so the last thing that came with just the bag. Okay, this is the last of the monthly thing, and then I'll show you the other thing I, I got um, with my points. This one is called IBY Beauty City Limits. It is the Lush Eyeshadows are highly pigmented, buttery, and blendable shades infused with rose hip seed oil for skin protecting properties. And the color on this one is Fire and Ice. Oh, how cute. Look at this little teeny compact. That is so cute. Love it. Okay, so this is the color. It is kind of a brown. Of course, it's showing kind of green, too. It's that brownish blue-green. I wasn't sure if I was going to like this one. Here's what it looks like on my finger. See how it's kind of that shiny? And that's what it'll look like. Right there in the bend of my hand. Good job there. Um, but I really actually kind of like that one. So that's it again. And this one was called Fire and Ice. Excuse me. So I like that little compact too. It's really, really cute. And if I've missed anybody's conversation, please feel free to... You guys can keep talking too. Um... I can't remember if I answered you, Pamela, how you asked how I was doing today. I'm doing really good. Um, ready for the rain to end. We've had a ton of rain and I'm done with rain. Okay, so the last thing is this is the one I ordered with my um with my extra points. Um, for those that don't know how that works, uh, when you get IPC, you for every time you review your products, your bag, um, and stuff like that, you get points. Um, I want to say it's 15 points per, per product you do. And I want to say your bag is 20 and then you can earn more points by, um, uh, following them on Twitter. Uh, I think the other one is Instagram, I believe. And then you get five free bags um, when you sign up. And you can pass these free bags out to friends um, or somebody who you think would like to join. So I have had recently had one. I still actually have four free bags that I have not um, actually passed out. So if anybody is interested in joining, like I said, it is two months. It's 10 per month. Um, and you can pay it monthly. It's not like um, some of the other ones where you have to pay like in quarters of the year. Um, and you can quit at any time. I have unsubscribed at one point uh, for a couple months so I could catch up on other things. Resubmitted myself to it again. So it's very easy. It's not, you know, hey, we're going to hold you down. We're going to keep paying. You know, you're going to keep paying. It's actually a really cool company. I actually enjoy getting it. So if anybody's interested... If you'll let me know in the comments, I will also get with you and I will send you because I got four more free bags left. I get points for the bags that you guys, when you guys um, subscribe, the same thing goes for you. When you guys get it, if you uh, pass it on to a friend and a friend decides to subscribe, 
you get those extra points. And then you can redeem, use your points to redeem for extra products that they will send you um, with your next bag. So I used it this time to get, it was a loose powder shadow. See, I like shadows. Shadows are my thing. And so most people are like, I like lipsticks. Sorry, I'm trying to get my foot sh reshifted around. I like lipsticks. I like this. Um, I like shadows. And so I got the Ella Eden London. And this one is called Alex. And it is a loose powder. Okay, well, it's still closed, so that's a good thing. Let me open it so you guys can see. Da -da 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 -da. While we're waiting for me to be able to pick this open, <laughs> um, how is everybody else's weekend starting? Hopefully, everybody is having a good weekend. All right, finally got that open. Okay, so then it comes in this little container like this. Um, tap a little bit out of my hand. There we go. Okay, and again, this one's name is Alex. Oh, that is really pretty. That is Alex. This is Alex right here. This is this one. There we go. It's kind of a goldy, it's kind of got a little bit of rose. It's hard to see. Oh, I hate this light in my room. I'm going to have to start doing these outside. But as you guys can see, um, uh, it's a real, that is a really pretty gold. Um, so, like, for me, it'd be used in the holidays. Um, I would use it during, like, Christmas, definitely New Year, stuff like that. So those are the colors. They're real, I got really pretty colors this time. Uh, Tammy, you said, I don't really wear makeup. If I do, it's eyeliner and mascara. I wouldn't know it. Okay, so here's my thing. I was like you. Um, I was not a big makeup person. Never have, never will be. But excuse me a friend of mine told me about this and was like look because I told him I was like I really want to start you know getting more into it but I don't know where to go to do it and I don't have the money to go to like Macy's and stuff like that and she told me about this and I like I told her I was like buying something a normal size for me is a waste of money because it's gonna go bad before I um before I use it all and so that's where the Ipsy bags and Sephora bags came in. Um, when I got it, uh, I was extremely excited because it didn't just come with makeup. I got facial care stuff. I got hair care stuff. And it is customizable. These things are custom. I hit myself in the face. These things are customizable. When you sign up, you go in and you put what you want. Do you want makeup? Do you just want hair stuff? Do you want um, perfumes? Do you want like facial stuff? Sometimes you get things that aren't just on, you know, what you what you ask for um, because they throw something different in just so you aren't set on the same thing. You can go in and change it at any time. You can re-customize it. Um, I know in the summer when I signed up, my skin tone is a lot darker than it normally is in the winter. So, like, I'll go in in probably November and change the coloring from, like, foundations and stuff to a lighter color. Um, because I lose a lot of what little bit of tan I do get. So it is re-customizable. Um, so you don't just have to get makeup. But with these, a lot of times you also get like a little video class on how to use it. Or especially with the Sephora bags. Um, those are really cool. And they come with like a big old chart. And like I said, next week when I get it, I'll show you guys. Um, but I love these. And this has actually gotten me back into... Um, the makeup um, whereas I was not big into it um, now of course I stick it all back in here till I go and put it in my makeup basket and like I said if you guys want to see that I'll bring it out one day it is packed full um, some things I have and I don't know why I have them because I probably never use them um, but some of the stuff I've got is pretty neat um, I have a whole drawer I'll have to take you guys into my bathroom one day and do that um, bring one of the babies with me um, but 
It is neat. If you ever are interested, let me know. Because, you know, I'm learning too. And I really enjoy what I'm learning. Astral said, you're, you're good. I've watched your video. I'm so excited um, for you to go to the Rose Doll Show. I cannot wait to see your videos. Again, I want to go really bad. <laughs> and that's one of my hopes in the next couple years. Sorry, I'm trying to re-shift this tripod. This sucker got stomped on by my big dog. And, like, she broke the little holder for my phone. She broke one of the pieces off. And I haven't had time to really go and buy a new one yet. And so it's like, we're going to limp this sucker along. <laughs> So, luckily, I've been able to use it today and don't have to hold the phone and look like a knucklehead. Um, but, uh, so these are really, these are really, really cool. I enjoy doing these. Um, I cannot wait to get my Sephora bag to show you guys. Um, they have, like, bi-monthly ones, too, for the same price, and you get, like, something different. It's just set for that time. And I've gotten a couple of those, um... I won't be getting one right now. I'm going to wait closer to Christmas to do the next one. Um, so that's kind of like the next next part of my hobby is it's not just I do a lot of reborns. That's, that's my main hobby, um, which is why I have the YouTube channel. But then I also started doing these. I like to do the box reviews. I've done a couple box reviews on, um, on the, excuse me on the um, baby boxes which are in my uh, playlist if you guys ever want to watch they're really kind of cool um, haven't done any new ones on that but uh, I like to do the box reviews those are fun I really enjoy doing them especially when I have the babies and then luckily I have somebody who always knows somebody that's pregnant so some of the stuff I pass on some of it I hold on to but um, to use with role playing but most of the stuff I'll pass back on um, to somebody else who might need it. Some of the stuff, I mean, it just doesn't apply to anything that what I would be doing in my reborning. So, my dog is, my dog is barking. My little, little dog is barking. Hold on, would you guys like to see him hand, hand me knucklehead over here? Just a second, I'll show you my, the one, he's the big, he thinks he's big and fierce and if you hear, you guys are probably hearing him growl. This is my big and fierce, what he thinks is big and fierce, and yeah, he's not. <laughs> he's my little Chewini. Um, so sometimes you guys will hear the barking, and that's this one, and sometimes he barks at nothing. <laughs> he's a nut. So this is, this is who you guys hear every so often um, during my videos, which is Baby Autobot. So can you say hi? Can you look at the camera? He has a really cute face, but he's a jerk. And then I have my little old man. I have bigger dogs, um, but we have, oh gosh, he's sweaty. Ugh. Then I have um, my little old man, which is Jingles. He's like, I'm not looking at the camera for nobody. But this is my, uh, he's my little, um, he's a lost a terrier mix. He's, he's looking at my son. My son's on the opposite end of the camera, and he's looking at my son like, uh, no. What is she doing? Can you at least look at the camera? I said, no. He's my one that likes to cuddle with the Reborns. If um, he can get into the bassinet, uh, this this dog will sleep with my Reborns. So I have to watch him. So, um, is there a... If there's any Reborns anybody would like to see, um, y'all can let me know and I will have somebody bring me one of them. Oh, and Astral, you were saying it's for your 40th birthday present. So, you and I must be the same age because I will turn 40 next year as well. Um, I hate saying that. I will turn 40 next year. Uh, I don't even want to think that. Um, but we must be the same age because I uh, turn 39 at the end of this year. And then I will turn 40 at the end of next year. And I'm totally not looking forward to that. My husband is teasing me about that because he's about five months older than me. A little over five months older than me. Yeah. So he always says he's the baby. And I'm like, yeah, younger. I'm sorry, younger. My son's sitting here going, younger mom. Yeah, he's younger. So he always calls me the old lady. Although I'm getting those old lady gray hairs. Those are called from my children. But I love them, no doubt. So, 
Um, but I'm just, I wanted August 8th. That's right, because you just had your birthday. Mine is in December. Hey, Lindsay, how are you? He's blowing raspberries at Jingles because Jingles is mad. So, um, I was going to tell you guys something else. What was I going to tell you? I'm pretty good. Uh, just did my Ipsy bag showing. And so, like I said, I'm waiting for the Sephora. I think I'm going to try the, bir the, I think I really am going to try the Birch Box, um, after the first of the year. Of course, Christmas is coming up and... So, it's like, gotta buy presents for the kids. School just started. So, um, hopefully I can get um, a subscription to that in January. Because, like I said, they, that one they say comes with, like, like a full-size product. But don't, don't think that with these, you don't always get a full-size product. Because a lot of times with the lipsticks, the nail polish. Because you can get nail polish, too. That was something else I get. I just don't sign up for nail polish because... I don't really, I never use it. Um, I think both of those two, you usually will get a full size. And sometimes you get a, a bigger compact of makeup. I mean, I got one um, eyeshadow that was like a five eyeshadow. And it was a pretty decent size. So, anyway. Um, so, tomorrow I'm going to do um another live most of these will be done in the evening um after everything has settled has settled down and my husband settled in and he's watching his shows and my kids are watching their shows so a lot of them will be done in the evening i apologize to those that are watching them during the day um, i will try to do a couple during the day um but it might be i like to have it really settled around the house so it's quiet and everything is not a bunch going on um but tomorrow I'm going to do a what's in my bag for um, my diaper bag. And then I need to start doing the, like, the outfits of the day and stuff. I haven't started doing those back again, but I need to. Um, you know, I don't know that we have shown you guys. There is a new addition in the conjo con conjoined nurseries of my daughter's and mine. Um, but we do, have an, we do actually have another baby. Tomorrow we are continuing painting. I cannot wait to see your works in progress. I looked at them last night. And you're doing really good. Let me, um, the one in the blue. I will show you guys the other new addition. Yes, I do. So you guys have seen Meredith. She's my bigger one. She's the Elliot sculpt. This one I do not know, actually know the sculpt on. Um, we don't actually know the sculpt on, um, it was given to my daughters by somebody else. So, um, but she's really cute. Lindsay said hi to whoever is here with me. Um, so I don't actually know the sculpt. And if anybody does know the sculpt, please let me know because I would like to know. Um, I've looked on the back of the neck. I've looked everywhere and I can't for nothing find what the name is. But I would like to introduce you guys to, this is... Bethany, um, as you guys see, she's got a little hair up in her twigs, but she does have more hair in the back, um, which needs to be fixed because she's been in the uh, bassinet. Uh, this is her little hand. This is the other little hand, which I like because it's an open. I don't have many that have actual fully openable hands. Um, I can show you the feet. They're in, of course, little um, unicorns because we all know that's what I like. But, that's her little tootsie. Uh, I'm trying to turn her right. Um, and then she's got really pretty little blue eyes. And so her name is Bethany. Um, we had not decided on a uh, middle name. I can't remember if the girls picked a middle name or not. <laughs> I'll have to ask them and they've both gone to bed. But, um, anyway, this is baby Bethany. I'm trying to get her shoe back on, guys. I'm sorry. So, but she's a cutie. She's got a little, uh, sucking her, it looks like she's sucking her little lip in. So, she's a cutie. And she's wearing, I'll show you her cute little skirt. She has got this super cute little flouncy skirt with kind of sparkly polka dots. It's hard to see. 
and the little sparkly waistband and then she's just wearing her little white and blue I'm sorry her blue and pink onesie so that is baby Bethany she joined the nursery she joined the nursery I think in July I think in July like the middle of July and I haven't done one I forgot <laughs> I haven't introduced her um, but so that brings us up to nine between the two between the girls and myself um, like I said last night uh, two that I'm hoping eventually to get is the real born Joseph three months and then the toddler Emmy because they are related um, although I was given some really cool news that um, there's another one Dominic um, that is related and then possibly there will be a toddler of the real born Joseph I'm gonna move you guys again um, so I kind of want to stick with those I really like those um, but there's some really cute ones I just saw another Tinkerbell uh, yes Darren thank you thank you it was Darren um, I saw the Tinkerbells I have one that is a premature which is Tambry and she's very very tiny and so I like Tambry but she, for me she doesn't fit like really comfortably in my arms um my daughters are very attached to her and so she's mine but she's theirs I don't know how to explain that she's mine and theirs um and so I've seen the Tinkerbell and she's so cute she's got the most cutest face and I think that one of my daughters wants a Tinkerbell. She thinks she's so pretty. Um, but the little face on that one is so pretty. Um, there's some other new... The Joyce sculpt I just saw today. I got a thing from Bountiful Baby. And that one was really cute too. Um, I don't know. There's so many new ones that are coming out. They're just so, so cute. It's like, how can you pick? <laughs> how do you pick? I'd be happy with any baby right now, truthfully. I, you know, I'm, I'm getting the baby fever again, but it's one of those, like, you know, Christmas and kids or doll. And, I mean, I got to put Christmas and kids before I put dolls. Um, but, <coughs> yeah, I'm getting, <coughs> excuse me, getting baby fever again. My son wants um, a monkey a chimpanzee my bad I was gonna say gorilla it's a chimpanzee um and they have some of those kits that you put together so that's my next option to look at um there's just so many I if I had tons of money I would have a whole room full of babies oh my gosh it's crazy um but yeah I got baby fever again it's just a matter of it's 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 gonna be a while <laughs> it's gonna be a while um I actually had signed up for one a giveaway and I was like the third place it was like if if the other two people didn't respond then it would have been mine I just had to pay it it was a beautiful beautiful baby but I kind of figured the first person I mean let's just be honest I kind of figured the first per first place person was gonna get it um I mean if you're Putting that much into it, you're going to be paying attention to it. But the baby was beautiful. And the artist is, like, super awesome. Um, she does this wonderful, wonderful jobs. Um, before I call her out on on YouTube, I, I will clear with her um, before I call her out. Because I, I some, some people aren't ready for their stuff to go to YouTube. Some people are. So, um, on my next video, if she's okay with it, I will definitely call her... Um, artists out and those of you guys that are artists let me know because I'm more than happy to um, promote your promote your sites if you guys have sites and stuff like that because you know I'm here I'm not an artist but I see the work that you guys put into your dolls and you put into you know such a labor of love into these things not just for the artistic thing but some of these women are doing them as memorial babies you know some of them are just like me who are collecting I do want a memorial baby for the baby I lost earlier this year um, but you know that's just not in the cards right now that is something I hope to get 
in the future, but, you know, unfortunately it's going to be in the future. Um, but you guys have such a labor of love when you do these, like a serious labor of love. And so anytime that, you know, you guys have got new babies coming out, you've got babies for sale, definitely let me, shoot me a message and I will more than happy to say, hey, you guys go check out my friend, you know, because I know you guys are like really rocking it right now. I have seen so many beautiful babies coming out right before the holidays. Um, and I know a lot of people try to do that so that the holiday babies go out. So I think one of the other ones, and this is funny to say, but one of the other ones I have really thought I wanted to get, and actually was what caught my eye um, originally in some of the Reborns community is the Grinch babies. I think they are so cute. The Grinch is my favorite, one of my favorite Christmas movies. And I have seen some of the most adorable Grinch babies. But I don't I don't know where you buy those to make them. I don't know what kits they are. Um, I don't see many people making them right now. Um, I've seen a couple last year. But I didn't see a huge amount. Um, you are taking a painting class on the 22nd of this month. Oh, I can't wait. That's cool. Definitely, if you're going to take a painting class, um, like either let's see some work in progress pictures because I'd love to see what, um, what you learn. Or if you're going to do a video, definitely let me know because I definitely want to check it out. Um, I'm, I've considered doing that and I'm hoping next year during the summer that's what I want to do. Um, I have two kids that are really interested in Reborn, so I thought maybe the three of us would take the class because um, two of them pretty artistic too so maybe they would enjoy learning too um so definitely tell me what um what what you learn and share your experience because i know that'll be really cool and fun to watch um but yeah the the grinch babies are some of my favorite ones um i love when uh stephanie which is in love with reborns 2011 i love when she did molly as the grinch um I know there was some there was some controversy, um, and then Molly has since gone on to um, has since gone on to uh, a new mom, but I thought Molly as a Grinch was so so cute, um, and so fitting for Molly. <laughs> I mean, you just flat out was just so so fitting for Molly. Uh, I'm going to try and film a bit of the class. Yes, if you get a chance to, that would be really awesome because it would be really neat to be able to watch. Astral, you said there are free tutorials. Yeah, I've been kind of watching some of the free tutorials um, off and on. I've watched some of just the live of the artist painting. Another one I would love to... I don't know if I, so much if I would want a class or just like sit down with her. There's two other artists that I'd love to sit down with. Um, Chenza... Chinza, Chinza dolls um, simply because she, I've watched her like live sculpt and yeah I don't have that kind of talent <laughs> not even close uh, and her babies are so amazing so so amazing and um, I like Noe art dolls um, she does a lot of the silicone babies and her babies are so pretty um, I would I would love to have a silicone baby but I still have kids I have pets and I know that those are extremely, you know, in-depth taking care of them, keep pet hair off of them, keep, just to keep anything off of them. And I, you know, I don't have that kind of time right now. <laughs> Although I would love to have one. They're beautiful. Um, but she makes some gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous babies. McPherson has nice air dry classes. You know, I've heard that McPherson's has really cool um, classes for those things. And I'll, I may have to... Um, look in that look into that excuse me um i like them of course i um i like bean shanine she makes some of the cutest babies they're uh, you know for alternative babies and they're so cute with their you know brightly colored hair and stuff like that she just makes some really awesome babies everybody does though i mean you guys are amazing everybody that's doing it and learning um they're just amazing. It's so cool. 
to see how everybody's doing it and how everybody's learning and what y'all are learning and sharing with all the rest of the group. So, anyway, again, here I am rambling again. I'm picking my class at a McPherson's craft store in Ontario, Canada. You know, I didn't know they actually had a craft store. Maybe it's just not around here. They don't have one. Um, her cake smash babies. Yes, her cake smash babies are awesome. That was the one I kind of figured my son would want. Um, but I don't know that I've actually shown him the cake smash babies. They're so cute. Somebody else made, and I can't remember who it was, but made this really, really, like, highly realistic looking, um, Pennywise doll and I'll have to look back again and see who that was like down to the hair was the same like that bright orange it was like done exactly the same the hair they had made the little outfit for it the face was like crazy close I was like holy crap I love it that's my favorite one of my favorite horror movies and even my I told my husband I said, that thing would be so awesome that baby would be awesome to have as a display. I don't know that I could ever just have it as, you know, one of the babies where I would want to hold and cuddle because I'd be afraid I would mess him up. But they, she, this person made the most amazing dolls. Um, especially that one. There have just been some really cool things that have come out lately. So I can't wait, um, to miss, uh, Tammy to see, I'm trying to get this thing to come back up. Uh, I can't wait to see what, uh, what you learn because that'll be really awesome. Um, Hopefully, hopefully I can find some classes next year to try. Um, I know it's pretty popular in this, uh, in this area. I found there's a lot more people that like Reborns. Annie's Pennywise. Yeah, she did a really cute Pennywise, too. I can't remember who won Pennywise. I have Caspian, which I need to show him again. He's in the, um... He's in my girls' nursery uh, in their crib, and because the girls have just kind of fallen in love with him, it's so funny. They um, they just they're they're so choosy. Like they'll come through and they'll be like, "Oh, well, I really want to, I really want to, you know, hold." Especially my older of the two girls, she she really is big on going through and like sacred emotions. That so that's right. I remember that. Um, picking, you know, which one she likes the most, and I think today I want to go rock this one, and I, you know, so on and so forth, so I live about 45 minutes from, it's an amazing place, I'm going to buy everything I will need to reborn, oh, don't, don't, don't disappear, I hate when that does that, it doesn't stay long enough for me to finish reading, I have a video on my channel the store, oh, okay, okay, it's cool, so I'll have to go and look at it, um, since you have a video, because I don't think there's a McPherson's or if there is, it's not one close to me. I mean, I mean, I live in a pretty large populated area of um, Texas, but I don't think there's one nearby me, so I'll have to look because I would definitely love to go and check that one out. I mean, I know we have like Hobby Lobby and we have Michaels, but I don't think they have a lot of that stuff. They at least, I know they don't have the dolls and the body kits and stuff like that. Um, like with, at least with McPherson's, you can go there and look at that kind of stuff, so. I can't wait to see what you learn. But um, here I am rambling on again. So, but I really enjoyed talking to you guys. Like I said last night, I've missed everybody. And I'm super excited to um, maybe get a little more involved back into my channel again. Um, like I said, tomorrow I'll do a, uh, a what's in my bag. And I think I'm going to have Anaya with me tomorrow. You guys haven't seen Anaya in a long time. Um... She's doing good. She's actually asleep in the crib, but I think it's all the, it's only one place, but they ship all over the world. Okay, so, wow, then you're like, that's really cool. Then that means you're getting, like, right there. So, that'll be really cool. I'll definitely go to your channel. Excuse me. Oh, I'll go to your channel and um, check it out. Sorry, guys. Uh, I keep getting notifications popping up and um watch your video because i don't remember seeing it but i'm willing to bet it I, is i've seen it in passing so i'll go check it out because i would definitely like to see what it looks like in there so i'm not going to keep you guys any later since it's friday night but i have really missed you guys i really look forward to talking to you guys again 
Um, like I said, I'll be on tomorrow. Uh, about the same time, I'll bring Anaya with me. And we will talk again tomorrow. I hope you guys have a great day tomorrow and a good weekend. And I love you guys very much. Y'all have a good night. Bye, guys.